If you're okay with being here, then I'm okay with being here. Um, because of what, here, you can have this one, Kath, because I'm not sitting. I won't be here that long. Um, because of requests from a couple of council people, we have reconsidered, and I think we've come up, the committee's come up with a reasonable alternative. Reba's going to present it. You guys can accept it or not. And we will take it back to council, and if it's approved, that's what will happen. If it's not approved, then we're right back where we were. Okay, uh, this is, like he said, something that I will take back to council to see if they agree to this. Um, we have not done that. Um, so this is just a, a proposal for council. Uh, and it's uh, because I, I uh, clearly heard that the Cars Club does not spend all of its money and spends it conservatively because of the cost of the roll-offs and they have to pick and choose what they're disposing of. Um, so I'm willing to take this back to council um, so that the Cars Club can do whatever they want in the community. This would be uh, worth up to 10 free roll-offs plus delivery and pickup. Um, that would be for 20 yards, that would be worth around $3,450, $3,450. If it's for a 30 yard um, roll off, it's for $3,950. Also included in this would be 15 free truckloads of solid waste disposal. disposal. Um, that would be worth $4,728 to $6,738 uh, unless you have, unless the load contains sod, concrete, manure, asphalt, dirt, tiles, uh, bricks, things like that, then in which case the load is worth three times as much. That is has a uh, potential worth of twenty nine fifty five, and we would do three cases of heavy duty um, outdoor trash bags. Um, this would be um, run through waste management facilities and would be paid for by the city. Um, the only requirement would be that the addresses, of course, would be for the cleanup sites of Commerce City residential addresses and not for empty residential properties or for remodeling of properties. And um, the Cars Club would work um, through the Neighborhood Services Department. Um, so that's the, that's the proposal. This is worth approximately $6,000 more than the Cars Club requested. Define what you mean when you say work through Neighborhood Services. Well, it would, we would have to set up how it would be paid for. This is a matter of it has to be paid for, so an account would be set up at waste management. You have a certain way of picking sites, whatever that happens to be with your club. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Okay, what would happen is those sites would need to be someone who is either in trouble, getting in trouble, or getting out of trouble. Or a senior, or a, or senior. a handicapped person, yeah. or something like that. So, I mean, that's strictly just so that Neighborhood Services knows what's happening and where it's being So basically done. they would have the authority to tell us that we could or could not clean up the services. Oh, no, 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 it just needs to be through them. So they know that today you're at 62nd and Holly. And that things could be paid for. Like yeah. the delivery for the roll-off would be at this address. And would the city order the roll-offs and all them? Um, that well, that's what happen? neighborhood services, you would call and say, we need a roll-off at this okay. such and such an address, and they would make arrangements to have the roll-off delivered and picked up. So just to be real clear, we get either 10 free roll-offs, or how many? No, it's in close. Plus. Oh, 15 plus. free mm. truckloads. You this may have some yards that you don't need a roll-off. Right. Exactly, yeah, that's yeah. That my concern. Yeah, you may not need that <laughs> roll-off. So it wouldn't be fair for us to tell you roll-offs. You have a house that only has a couple of pickup loads. So that way you can use the pickup loads instead of. But if you used them all, you can use them all. So can you so. clarify slightly about the truck load? Oh, locked together. Um, ordinarily, we use a 6 by 16 foot trailer. We really don't use a... Pick up well, it would same. be whatever is equitable. Fifteen yeah. loads. Yeah, and it's cheaper to do it by the trailer. That's fine. By the yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's Get whatever. A better, better deal out of whatever you decide you're going to use is what we'll pay for. I mean, truckloaded. We didn't have any idea of how what you use. 
So, yeah, we don't have any problem at all with that. And if we have a yard that has all kinds of different products, then I take my truck and we put all the recyclable in it, okay. and I take the recyclable up to the dump station on Highway 2 and put it there. Yeah. And how does that check it back to the owners? I mean, it's just a question. Check? No what, check. The recyclables? The, the recyclables no, are don't get paid no, for any of volunteer. That. It's all drop off. Only if you oh, take okay. things to the okay. recycling do uh, it, it, it is is what? What? Yeah. 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 try really hard right. not to take recyclable objects to the dump. Yeah. yeah. So That's we fine. separate <coughs> a mass between them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, there wouldn't be a cost on that, correct? Yeah. Well, that's what we do. No, that's free. The recyclables yeah. we're able to dispose of at no cost to yeah. anybody. The uh, what you asked about, I think, is probably the metallic portions okay. of items that we collect from these property cleanups. And usually what we do with those, uh, I personally process that into prepared steel. That is delivered to Rocky Mountain Recycling. They issue us usually cash, and that money is funneled back into the group. I do not personally keep any of that money. Okay. Well, if that's your procedure, then that's your procedure. Recycle money, recycle so, money. So okay. the details of this can be, if council yeah. approves it, um, would be worked out um, with um, however this would be paid for. Okay. And as you can tell, this is probably more than five times what you asked for. And I have something to say, a comment. Um, I think what you're doing is a good thing, a very, very good thing. Um, that was the number one complaint the first time I ran was uh, you know junky yards and all that so it's good that we have you serving the community this way okay uh, I have a family emergency coming up we're done uh -huh. we're finished sir and okay. what I wanted to say is there's about 75 or 100 people from the cars club participates in this we preach cleanup it encourages us to clean up our own yards and we are leaders in the clean up thing and that has value that should mean something to the city well this is worth around six or seven thousand dollars will we be able to get this proposal in a written form because for our group uh, our decisions are made on a semi-diplomatic manner. We would need to take this proposal in a written form to the group's core leaders. Yeah. I, you know, about how it's written when it's brought in front of council. Yeah. Won't that be yeah. good enough? Yeah. yeah. Well, it's hard for us <coughs> to, or it's hard for me, to bring back to the membership of the group a written a, a verbal proposal because it's been my experience that sometimes Mr. Flannery, uh, Mr. Flannery um, I don't have any objection to them just having something that says oh I'm sorry or buoyancy oh, there. but we can do that can't we just something sure. um, you know what, what what I would um, but it hasn't gone before council yet so yeah so it'd have to be approved by council before we could do anything yeah we, we I can get the details and put okay. it in a, in a memo and then, terrific um, we can schedule it for a uh, council yes meeting. that's but we will we'll have to do the proposal to council first because if they don't accept it then we're back to done but and that's probably the order, Mayor. Yeah. Okay. And it, it's it's putting it in a report form, bringing it to council. Council blesses it, and then gotcha. then you guys. I mean, you know, it, 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 if we bring it, if you if we if you get it and bring it back to your meeting, and then you guys say great, if you go to the council and it may change. So I think it, it's probably better the other way around. If we put it in a report form, bring it to council, then the council. Can weigh in on it, and then you've got a, an actual, clear, clear proposal that that you can act on. Okay. This well, proposal doesn't provide any means <coughs> for us to purchase tools and equipment that we need for these cleanups, nor does it provide any means for us to have any kind of refreshments while we're working or any of that. According to this proposal, no, it does not. I believe. Is this a a final offer? Or is this offer negotiable? The offer is not negotiable to you. It might be negotiable at council. Bobby. 
I'd like to say.